Yeah, here I am, guy. The process to try to troubleshoot the P P four zero eight zero code, something related to the fan system not working, fan number one system circuit open. Anyway, basic steps. First of all, you have to check if your multimeter is working. So just test the 12 volts, okay? And the fact that I have the Alpha OBD available give me some extra tools to try to carry out these tests. And exactly now what I am going to do is test if the blue wiring, which suppose it's supposed to come from the gear from the from the fuse box, it's sending power once uh, triggered by the system. There are several different parameters to trigger this signal. It's going to be high temperature, uh, if the car is hot, if you turn on the AC, all those parameters should trigger the signal to, to, to turn the fans on. For the record, my car has two fans. It's the, you know, the HD cooling system, which means uh, I don't have, this car doesn't have a straight connection to the fan number one. This wiring goes through the power fan, power radiator management box, and there the, the box has two independent wirings going toward fan number one and fan number two. What I'm going to test now, it's trigger the Alpha OBD. We have this option here, power cooling fan power duty cycle, and monitor if the blue wiring, which it's supposed to come from the fuse box, it's sending any voltage, any power, okay? I'm gonna connect the, the positive pointer here. Okay, it's connected. The negative is on the negative on the battery it could be any ground connection and now i'm gonna trigger the the duty cycle you can hear you can hear the fuse box clicking and you can see the power going so you can assume that the connection between the fuse box and the wiring it's okay because it's sending power based on based on the on the command sent by the now I have tested that the connection between the fuse box and the wiring it seems to be okay because the power is being sent to the blue wire which triggers the post to start the fence. What I'm going to do now it's gonna be a new test. I'm going to reconnect this line to clean up the 0480 error, okay? I'm gonna try to redo this test and see if the fans will go into start. Because if you trigger the, the fan radiator cycle using the Alpha OBD, it's supposed to trigger both fans, not only one, okay? Because that signal means turn everything on. That's gonna be the next test. So the line now, it's connected, okay? I'm gonna clean up the errors using the Alpha OBD, and I'm gonna trigger the cycle again, expecting to see both fans to spin, okay? So, okay, I have cleaned up the defaults. The car is on, but the engine doesn't have to be running. And I am going to trigger the radiator cycle. Reconnecting. No errors. This one here is spinning. But the second one is not spinning. As you can see here, we have two independent lines for each fan. 
and those lines come from comes from this power module here this freaking thing which it's very hard to reach this guy here the signal comes to this guy and this guy have two independent outbound electrical lines for each fan most likely my problem it's here i have to replace this guy ah just for the record i have already replaced the the tip on box and the problem remains there it's still happening most likely my problem it's there the wiring seems to be okay the signal is coming over here from here goes to this box and this box it's supposed to trigger independently each fan but the second one is not working i think i found the issue that's it